What's the length of that sword? Holy shit! What the fu- Margit the Fell Omen. My worst enemy. Or as I like to call him, Walmart Gandalf. This man has killed me countless times, therefore earning himself a spot on my list of enemies. But our relationship wasn't always this sour. Let's go back and see how we got to We begin our journey as a wretch, which is this game's version of a deprived class. In the first minute of the game, my computer crashed in the middle of the intro screen. So I rebooted my computer and decided to take out my anger on the nearby corpse by ripping off their finger. After staring at my creation for longer than I would like to admit, I decided to boost my morale by beating the first enemy on my first try. It can't be that hard, right? I mean, it's the first boss, what could possibly- Whoa! <laughs> what was that? After a close battle between me and the first boss that really anyone could have won. I woke up in a dark cave, naked and afraid. I expertly maneuvered and defeated all the enemies in my way with ease. As I opened the last door between me and freedom, I let my guard down. I had escaped the hellhole I was abducted to, given... I was still naked, but hey, I got a feeling that things are looking up for me, okay? I was even given a small golden effigy on my arrival to the land above. I thought I'd arrived at a place of friendly NPCs, but I was clearly mistaken. Is the guy over here, is he friendly? Friend! Hello, friend! Hello there, my good sir. That's a boss. I am not doing any damage whatsoever. Oh, what a fucking twist! Yeah, le remind me to never walk up to that guy again. He seems a little bit too hard. Yeah, I had no idea how right I was. But not about this boss, but the bosses in this game in general. Also, some of the enemies I was about to face... You see, it... At first, I thought this game was going to be easy to please a wider audience. Boy, was I wrong. Small people. Yeah, I'm dead. I gotta take care of the small people first. You're done. Sorry, you're done in a second when I realize what the controls are. You're Any second now. There you go. You're done. Bored. You little fucking bastard. You didn't tell me you had the poise of a fucking madman? A tank even? Have you heard of the Finger Maidens? Is it a band? What? Where did that come from? Whoa! Calm the fuck down, dude. That is so fast. Get out! I thought they couldn't come in here. Oh, you had poise. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Yeah, easy. You know what? Get fucked. I'll leave you to tell the tale. Warn the others. Fear me. For I hold the light that you cannot touch, losers. So far we've fought an impossible spider, a man who can turn like he has no bones in his body. Oh, what a fucking twist! A big man with big feet. 
Yeah, I'm dead. And a man with a dream. You didn't tell me you had the poise of a fucking madman? A tank, even? But we've not met a real boss yet, you know? The one with, like, the classic fog that you step through, like in the old Dark Souls games. Until now, meet my new friend, Walmart Gandalf. The Voldemort to my Harry Potter, the wolf of my Little Red Riding Hood, the Russia to my Europe. Actually, I've been speaking over him this whole time. Let's let's see what he has to say. Someone must extinguish thy flame. Let it be Margit the Fell. That scared me. I didn't think it was gonna throw it. This guy is fucking chunky. Okay, he always throws that. But these foolish ambitions. This guy is hard. This is the first boss fight, and he's actually like really difficult. But these foolish ambitions. This guy is to too rest. hard. Put these foolish ambitions to rest. Man. I've taken up a tenth of your health. Four feet now, and I'll let you live. Okay, maybe I don't, you don't need to force it. <laughs> I'll be back! You have but one life, I have immortal! I'm back! Ah, yes. Have you ever seen Day After Tomorrow? Well, I'm about to fucking Day After Tomorrow your ass. Come on, pussy fart. Get off the edge. Unless you're planning to jump. I'll be back! I'll return! Stronger than ever! I tried beating him for about 40 minutes, but since this was my best attempt... Okay, maybe I don't, you don't need to force it. <laughs> I decided to explore a bit and come back when I was strong enough to actually fight him. I'll, I'll come back when I'm stronger. You won this fight, but I, I'll be back another day. You wait, good sir, you wait. Your fingers, please, your fingers. Yeah, I think I'll take my chances with the boss. I'm back! Foolish ambitions to rest. Fine, have my fingers. <sighs> okay, that's enough. Okay, so now that that's over, let's see what I have to do to actually be able to beat the boss. I need runes to level up, because that seems to be the main issue. I'm, I haven't really leveled at all so far. And pretty much instantly after leaving the boss, the game decides to mock me over it. For a small donation, I'd be happy to share my knowledge. Not enough runes to donate. Oh, <laughs> oh I don't even have 10 runes to give to this poor man. I went off exploring to find places where I could easily farm some runes, and I found this location. I don't even have to do anything. The spectral bodies are fighting the humans and rewarding me for watching. As long as I keep a safe distance, I'll be able- Okay, it was good while it lasted. But hey, I got almost 2000 souls from doing that. And now we've gone from level 6 to level 8. This is not gonna work long term though. While I got almost 2000 runes by doing this, it took me a good like 40 minutes to do it. We're gonna have to do something else to get the power that we need to defeat the boss.
your reach kind of sucks, man. Oh, I take it back. Okay, calm down. Don't need to be so fucking competitive. Jeez. I went off to find a spot where I could farm runes or potentially get armor or better weapons. But I found some hard enemies because I went a little bit too far off the beaten path. So I decided to go back to the boss again and this time just try and work out the mechanics with a sword instead of the club. I'm back, pussy! Memorize, never heal after you try to hit him. I got you, man. I may have used all my healing and I may have only done like 5% health damage on you, but you got me. Fair and square. But nothing to say to you. I admit singular defeat in one to one combat and I wish to cheat. Welcome. Hello, Sorcerer Ro Roger. Are you ready, man? Roger! Roger! These foolish that was quick. I wish to let Sorcerer Roger uh, do the entire battle for me. If that... Uh, if that works. It didn't work. Uh, actually, I would go as far as to say that Roger, on his own, is absolutely useless. The man has no fears whatsoever and no care for his own safety. He will literally run into the boss without even attempting to dodge the attacks and just go full on berserker mode. This is where my mental stability started to decline rapidly in the gameplay. Sorcerer Roger, welcome back my good friend. We traverse the fog once again, old friend. Damn. Roger, my good sir. We have the fight to do again. We will kill the funny man. Yes, yeah, Sorcerer Roger, welcome. We will kill the funny Margaret the Fell Omen. Ah! Dude, come on. I thought I was out of range. Roger, we must try first through the Safag. Roger, this might be the one. No, 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 no. He has a second face! What the frick? Okay, Me memorize. Don't try and fly away from the hit. Fly towards the hit. Run into the fire, as they say. It's fine, Roger. We're getting closer. The victory will be worth it. Do you hear the smack the man is talking about you? You know, I heard once that he said that your hat wasn't even fashionable. Yeah, I know. Did you hear that, Roger? Your hat sucks! He said it himself! Roger! Roger? Oh, I didn't summon him. Look at that fabulous hat. Of course, it's gorgeous. Don't hit Roger, asshole. Fuck me. Oh, fuck you. Fuck off! To rest. What the fuck? Foolish ambitions to rest. I am not doing this until I'm so overpowered that I will one-tap your fucking fake little pussy Gandalf ass, okay? At this point, I've been at it for about one or two more hours. I, I don't even know anymore. And I decided that, okay, I'm gonna have to go and get some more XP and probably better weapons and finally be able to kill this boss because right now I do about 60 damage per hit which is not good enough. This is also when I was pretty mad so <laughs> yeah I'll just let you watch. Excuse me I'm gonna go and try hard fucking mode. Farm the fuck out of these fuckers. Yeah I killed your little friend. What are you gonna do huh? Pussy fart? How did I not hit him there? How did I fucking not hit him? Fuck you, pussy ass. Fuck you, pussy ass. Fuck off. Get fucked. Get fucked.
Get wrecked, loser. We're going fucking aggressive now. Wrecked, loser. Same faith as your partner, loser. Uh... Don't look at me. I don't want to fight. Oh! There's something in here. Okay, Lord Swan Greatsword. Yes! Fuck yeah! A fucking weapon. Let's go! I had finally found a new weapon for my guy. And the only problem seemed to be that I needed more strength. And, you know, since I'm already farming s runes, almost at souls, uh, might as well just put those into strength so I can use the new weapon. Come on, dude. It's just between you and me. Or it was just between you and me. There's quite a few of you guys. Think maybe we can talk about this? I found a boss in a dungeon when I backtracked a little bit. And he was so much easier than Margit the Fell. Oh my god. But the only problem was he didn't give me that many runes. He only gave about a thousand runes and a talisman when I beat him. But hey, it's it's a step in the right direction. Beastman of Farum Asol. Get fucked! Loser! Not even hard. Flame Drake Talisman! And a thousand runes. I need strength. So I'd finally managed to get enough runes to actually get the strength I needed to use the new weapon that we have acquired. I'd also managed to get a shield. But this wasn't really enough to kill the boss. Well, it was almost enough, but I I felt confident. So I went back to the boss once again to try my luck. And I got really close a couple of times. Put these foolish ambitions to rest. So close. So fucking close. Yeah. That's definitely what I want to do. What's the length of that sword? Holy shit! What the fuck? Put these foolish ambitions to rest. Let's try once without Roger. I'm still having some issues with beating the boss, but I'm getting really close. I just need a little bit more power, armor, and just, you know, levels, essentially. So it's time once again to backtrack a little bit. Remember that horseman in the beginning of the game? Oh, what a fucking twist! Yeah, that guy. We're going back for revenge, and now I think we should be powerful enough to actually beat him as well.
almost there. I know stitching, huh? Ah! Oh! What a hit, my dude. One more, I guess. Let's go! Get fucked! Get fucked! Golden Halberd. Thank you. After defeating the man on the horseback, I decided that the bosses before Margit are probably a lot easier. So I should probably kill them first, get the runes, and then go to Margaret the Fell. I didn't really find that many bosses though. I found the Tree Sentinel. One more, I guess. The Bloodhound Knight Daruel. Daruel? I'm not to pronounce that. Get fucked! Get fucked! Killing you ninja style! Yeah! Let's go! Let's fucking go! And the Crucible Knight. Now, the Crucible Knight was a little bit too hard for me. I don't think I'll be fighting this guy currently, but that was perfectly fine. I'd already killed the Tree Sentinel and the Hound gave me a beautiful curved sword that I would be using for the foreseeable future. I'd also gained some armor by buying it from vendors and uh, killing normal enemies. So after around 7 hours of preparing for this boss fight, I have finally gotten to a place where I feel comfortable fighting him. I've been at this for 7 hours though, so I think I should probably get some rest before I attempt the boss again. It is Friday afternoon. It's a sunny afternoon. That doesn't make any sense. It's a sunny evening. Uh, the temperature outside is 427 degrees Fahrenheit and uh, it keeps increasing gradually by the second. I think that it will keep increasing until I beat this boss. Hey! Let's go. Damn, 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 damn. Damn, I missed. Oh, I got... I, that was my fault. Damn. Nice, dude. Well, thou art a passing skill. Warrior blood must move back in thy veins. Tarnished. Roger, don't die. 
Damn. Nice. Come on, man. Don't die on me. Fucking careful, dude. Oh. Okay, okay. It's fine. It's fine. Don't panic. You know this a million times? Easy! Oh my god, first try, zero deaths, fucking easy. Let's fucking go. Oh my god. Fucking Walmart Gandalf can't. He doesn't stand a chance. Absolutely destroyed. Not even close! Fucking easy! 9,000 souls? Thank you guys for watching the video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked the video, like it. Comment if you have any tips on how I can improve with my videos. And uh, subscribe to the channel if you like this type of video as well. Yeah, thank you guys for watching, see ya! We're doing making progress again, it's fine. So get him far away from Roger. Pussy boy. There's all my healing already pretty much. Come on, Roger! What are you doing? Roger! Did you get fucking stupefied? <laughs> 